Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's okay. Hope you're doing well, keeping warm. So we are going to Manchester. My partner is actually already in Manchester. He went on a, he had like a work do night out thing uh, last night. So he went early on the train and I'm going to drive over today and we're going to stay in the Kimpton Hotel. So it should be pretty nice. I think it's quite a, quite a nice hotel. Um, and then we'll just, I'll just take you along with me. And uh, yeah, so it's a bit of a road trip actually. It's taken me ages to pack. Finally, I've got everything in the car because we're going to do our skiing at the Chill Factory. I think it's the Chill Factory, I think it's called, or Chill Central, whatever. So we're going to do that uh, tomorrow. So today it's packing the car, loading it, driving it over. But because it's just me, I've got to make sure that I've got everything. So basically, I've loaded the suitcases in, I've loaded the ski gear, Alex's presents, a few bits and bobs. Um, and yeah, I'm pretty much done. <laughs> so I'll take you along with, with me. Um, I just need to grab a quick drink of juice because I've not had much juice this morning and then we can hit the road. So yeah, I um, hope you enjoy it. Hey, I've made it to the hotel, just checked in brought our luggage up and stuff. So I'll give you a quick room tour. It's a very nice hotel. So this is the living area of the room. And look, it's got a Christmas tree. How pretty is that? I don't think I've stayed in a, in a hotel room with a Christmas tree in. And then we've got uh, an actual vinyl player. So I noticed straight away, you've got a Madonna, take that, Backstreet Boys. But yeah, this is the the main, um, the main area of the suite. Very, very nice. You've got the dining room area to the left, bit of a workstation in the far corner, and then over here you've got the this like old, like uh, antique unit with these cool, cool light bulbs. So basically, you've got your Nespresso and coffee stuff here. I saw you've got what puts have we got? Oh, it doesn't say, but you've got a couple of nice ones, probably a couple of decaf. And then this leather thing pulls the fridge open. And it's got, and on the sixth day, God created Manchester, which is really cool, because I remember that in town in the northern quarter near Affleck. So they've given us two bottles of water, and I think there's a beer, but they were so nice, and they've given us a couple more beers. And then they treated us to this Prosecco um, on ice. And also this chocolate bar for Alex, but he doesn't actually eat chocolate. He sometimes eats dark chocolate, but not milk. So that'll be mine. And then they give us this lovely message. But yeah, so this is the main area. And then I'll take you through into the bedroom. But look at this, you got like a, we have like a proper little cocktail bar stand thing. I really want one of these at home to go on the, uh, oh, I'd like a sort of, poof area and then pop this on so it's like a coffee table as well but yeah this is the main bedroom so you've got a four pedestal to bed it's such a lovely color scheme they've got really nice whoever's designed it has done really well so you've got such a lovely like this mustard throw oh it's such a cozy bed as well and then these are cute pillows with with butterflies on and I spotted that you've got one of like vintagey looking radios on the left on my side and then a nice little down so i'll take you back through to the main room but you've got these really cute little pieces and like details you have this cute london style phone with the uh it says kimpton clock tower hotel in the middle and then this is probably my one of my favorite little touches in the entire suite it's this really heavy brass doorstop but in the shape of a shoe, an actual, well it is an actual shoe, it's hollow in the middle. How nice is that? How stylish is that? Probably cost a fortune, but very heavy, very cool. So yeah, I'll take you through to the bathroom, which is at the other side of the suite. I think this is the signature suite. And so you've got this really cool mosaic -y floor, sort of an English style vanity standalone vanity unit thing and you've got a spotted straight away you've got these rainbow bar hand and body lotions but they just smell very nice 
That's the thing with five star hotels, you just get these extra details which are really, really cute. So you've got this little rainbow bar soap. Yeah. I just love the fact that it says rainbow on. I just think it's it's nice. You've got these like, vintagey looking or retro -y looking lights. And then the main stand, stand up walking shower for two. In the middle, again you've got your uh, your rainbow, your rainbow bar, shampoo, conditioner, <laughs> bath mat. And then obviously your toilet and stuff with your uh, your artwork. I just love the sort of homage to Manchester, having all the little bees and stuff. Very big building, I think it's got over 260 or 270 bedrooms. Just went to Arches and we've got ourselves two of these Mad, Mad, is it Mad Max or Mad? Mac Man. Mac Man boxes. So I've not got jalapenos because I find it too spicy. Basically you get a burger and it's got like a, a hash brown, I think in the middle, and crinkle fries. So we're gonna have these two now and we've got another bottle of Prosecco to celebrate Alex's birthday. So yeah, let's get the party started. But yeah, we need some food really, so yum, let's enjoy. I just thought I'd show you this complimentary coffee tray section. So you get two caramel wafers, which is really nice. There is Metcalf sweet and salted popcorn. Sea and salt vinegar crisps. But what I think is really cool in here is you get this this grounded coffee. So you can see here from Manchester. So it's caramel cocoa proline flavour. And then you've got this little how to brew your fresh coffee in your room, which is so cute because basically you get these things, the little filters, you can see you pop it, pop it over your cup and then you pour obviously your water in there. But how nice is that? That's such a, a cute little touch. Coffee bags. These are very good. I've had these before. And you just, you literally just pop them in your, your cup like a tea bag. And then we have pure green tea from Taylor's Harrogate. Very nice tea, organic peppermint, and then a couple of Earl Grey's. So yeah, really, really thoughtful little selection actually. I've just made a nice cup of coffee, just chilling, reading this book, which is actually really cool. It's called, oh, one minute, let's put my coffee down. It's called Rainbow Evolution. It was just on the table. But it's got some really cool bits and bobs in it. You can see the remnants there of the arches. We've obliterated them. I've obliterated this chocolate that Alex got. Just really cute. But yeah, obliterated it. And we have realised that we can't actually drink the second bottle of Prosecco. So we're going to have that tomorrow night. Good morning. Up and feeling fresh. Had a lovely, lovely sleep. Just had a nice shower. Um, them Rainbow Bar products, very, very nice. Feeling very, very refreshed. So yeah, we're going to head down to breakfast now. It's Alex's birthday, so I've just wished him a big happy birthday. And we're going to go down and have a lovely breakfast and see what that's like. So I'll take you with me, just to give you a show, give you a little tour of the hotel. And then we've got our skiing booked for this afternoon, so our skiing lessons. So we'll head there and I'll take you with us. So yeah, let's go and have some brekkie. There's a songbird singing in 
what for his spinny. Really nice, really nice day actually. Sorry, uh, very sunny and bright. Yeah, we could do. Should we head up King Street? Should we head up King Street? Yeah. Sounds nice. Look how sunny it is. Oh, with the lights? Yeah, really. Situation though, one of them's soy and one of them's whole milk, and we're not too sure which. Do you want me to do the test? I'll test. Guess what's good. This one smells. I think that's soy. That's what I'm this one. No, it's oat. It's oh, is it oat? That one's oat. That's nice. Mm. Yeah, it's really cool here. Yeah. Very edgy. We just got to the chill factor. I've just stood literally by the ski slope. It's so cool here, I like it. It's like, it kind of feels like you've, you've popped like the Swiss Alps or the Austrian Alps. This is the actual slope. But yeah, it's very cold in here. So Alex has got all booted up for his uh, snowboarding lesson. I've got a ski lesson. And, uh, and yeah, and then we'll probably get a, a drink afterwards. But I just love it. I just think it's such a cool thing to have in the UK. You know, you can come in any time, any, you know, any time of the year, you can pop here, put your skis on, have a little bit of a mess around. It's, it's so fun. So yeah, I can't obviously take my camera onto the slopes, but this is, uh, this is Chill Factor. This is one in Manchester. This is the inside of the centre. They've also got like a climbing wall. Um, and lots, lots of other bits really. You've got off, obviously all your ski shops. Um, they have a Nando's down there. We've got a Costa at the far end. Then you can have this like, they include like a free drink after your lesson. So you come up here as a group and sort of have a chit chat, have a free, a free beer, which is quite nice. And then this is sort of the view inside looking at the ski slope. So yeah, it's a really cool centre. Very cool. But uh, what else is there down there? There's a little, or oh, crystal ski who we've actually booked a trip to um, Austria uh, for January, so we booked them. They do like ski holiday packages and stuff, and then there's places for like buying snowboards and skis. And this is Snow and Rock, this is another uh, snowboarding shop. Well, we're back from skiing, so we've just had a shower, got ready, and we're gonna head to Kitten in Deansgate Square for a Japanese meal. This is where we're going, Kitten. Japanese restaurant at the bottom of Deansgate Square. Look how tall they are. So high. But yeah, we're looking forward to this, it looks nice. hotel so it was, it was lovely lovely evening um kitten was really nice the, the meal that we went to so it was japanesey and um, we enjoyed a bit of sushi had some cocktails we had like a lychee martini which was lovely and had a really nice dessert as well 
Uh, and Alex got a chance to blow out his candle, which was really cute. And the lychee martinis, oh my God, they were, <laughs> they were to die for. They were absolutely lovely. And then we went to, we went into town, but we just thought, you know what? We might as well head to the gay village because we know, we know it and we know it's going to be a good night out. It might just be a bit nicer and easier to sort of have a bit of a dance and stuff. So anyway, we went to the gay village. I went to a bar that I've not been to before. Um, but then we went to Molly's and we had a beer in Molly's upstairs, which was lovely. And then we went to GAY for a dance, a good boogie. So yeah, a really good night. I think Alex thoroughly enjoyed his birthday. Hopefully he enjoyed his birthday anyway. And uh, yeah, so we've got all tomorrow. So we'll have a nice sleep tonight. Yeah, I'll see you in the morning. Morning. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit croaky this morning. Had a really good night though. And actually slept really, really well. Um, so we're going to head down for breakfast and then probably pop back up to the room, chill out for a bit, collect our things, uh, tidy up and then head into Manchester. So let's go and get some breakfast and a nice latte because I am a little bit hungover. <laughs> we are going to check out, leave our bags in the, in the, with the hotel and then we'll have a bit of a walk around, a bit of a mooch around Manchester. It's not as sunny, I don't think, as yesterday, but it's not bad. It's not, it's not chucking it down, which is really, really good. Thoroughly enjoyed our stay. The staff have been wonderful, really, really nice to us. And uh, yeah, we'll go and explore and have a mooch around Manchester. Just like the sunrise needs the sky just like the blackbird needs to fly I gotta have you by my side Cause you make me feel alright I know some people play it cool But baby I ain't that kind of fool When I'm with you girl there ain't no rules Cause you make me feel alright We've just got in, we've just literally arrived back at home. Um, not a bad journey at all, it only took us a couple of hours in the end. Yeah, overall, genuinely, um, really, we really, really enjoyed our trip. It was just nice, it was um, relaxing. The Kimpton was a really good hotel. If anybody you know, wants any recommendations about where to stay in Manchester, the Kim I, would, I would highly recommend the Kimpton. So hopefully you enjoyed the vlog, hopefully you enjoyed coming along with us and seeing what we got up to. But yeah, please, please hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel. You should be because <laughs> I've only just launched it, really. Um, please get behind me. Please support me. Um, I'm very new on my journey, so there's lots of exciting content to come. And yeah, and please hit the like button if you like this video. So yeah, I look forward to speaking to you or seeing you soon.